the stomach um, has three layers of muscle unlike the rest of the, uh, the digestive tract which only has two. This is smooth muscle and uh, the outer layer is longitudinal. Then there is an inner circular layer. This is common to other areas of the digestive tract. The stomach though has a third layer. It has an innermost oblique layer of smooth muscle. Notice the nerves on the model. Uh, the uh, nervous system uh, comes in and directs the action of the smooth muscle. It's going to cause churning of the chyme inside the stomach and food is going to mix then with digestive juices. The opening to the stomach is guarded by the cardiac sphincter, also known as the lower esophageal sphincter. The upper part of the stomach that surrounds the opening is called the cardia. And then the stomach bulges out into the fundus. This can act as a holding area for excess food the bulk of the stomach is the body. As the stomach narrows and approaches the small intestine, it's known as the pylorus. Now when we open the stomach up, the lining of the stomach is thrown into folds called rugae. If we were to blow this up um, and look at it under a microscope, we would see many tiny microscopic pits descending from the surface uh, and uh, we would find many uh, cells that secrete gastric juices and mucus. The opening into the small intestine is guarded by the pyloric sphincter.